Hello everyone and welcome back to Wolf Quest where Mayhem's temporary goal of bothering the Wapiti Pack has been interrupted by some dispersal wolves it looks like. Let's go ahead, we'll see who this is. I don't even see where they are. Oh, Quadrant. Oh, this is the Quadrant Wolves or possibly Quadrant Wolf judging by the look of it. Yeah, 13F, two years old from the Quadrant Pack. Well, let's go say hello. Who are you, friend? Did we... We may have bumped into her before. I think we did, actually. Is this one of the deceptive gray coats? I think it might be. We'll go ahead. We'll we'll give her a little bit of a tail wag. Oh, she's play bowing. We'll, we'll see if we can get a little closer. Mayhem certainly is a playful wolf. A bit of a rowdy one. Oh, she's come right up to him. I, I think he appreciates that. <laughs> uh, he, he likes her, her confidence. Oh, look at that grin. Okay, okay. They're vibing a bit, I think. Does she have a floppy ear, too? Oh, we convinced her to get to know us better. It's hard to say. I think she does. Oh, can we come into the light over here so we can see you a little bit better? She's just lingering in the shadows. Hey, come here. Hold on. Come over here and say hi. I want to get a better look at you. <laughs> You've got darker furs. Hard to see in the, the shadows here. Oh, here she is. Hello. Oh my goodness, she ran right up to him. Wow. She does have a little floppy ear there. That's really cute. Oh, she seems like she could be a bit of a confident one as well, certainly uh, considering how eager she's been to, to make friends there. Oh, hi. Oh, I think he's finding this a bit endearing. She's got one of the older coats, it looks like. This is, I don't remember what exactly, which one it is. Um, but it's one of the older ones. I think this is one of the deceptive black coats in that it can be either black or gray. She is three-star diversity, so I don't uh, I don't think it's probably a black coat. I think it's one of the um, one of the gray ones that tends to look black. Oh, she's running. Where's she going? You good? You good? We'll go ahead. We'll we'll give her a nice little sniff here. Oh, hello there. She certainly does seem to be a pretty, uh, pretty friendly soul, that's for sure. Look at how she keeps coming right up to him. I, I think May may have found a friend. <laughs> Who's over? What? What's over here? Oh, no wonder you were running. That's a bear. Why is there a bear over there? He's just chilling. Well, okay then. I guess that's what she is moving away from, probably. But I think, um, I think 13F could be a good possible, possible option here. They, they certainly seem to be getting along quite re well, and I think she kind of, um, I think her initial outgoing nature kind of, uh, kind of impressed him a little bit. Uh, she certainly, she certainly seemed quite eager to just run right over and get to know him, and I think that, that's kind of how he can be sometimes, too. He likes... He like he, he's definitely an exuberant wolf. I think we'll go ahead and we'll try and court her here. So we've got 13F. Yeah, why are you here? Why are you here? Get out! Get out! All right. Um, let's uh, now that now that that's now that that's over with, let's give her a nice little tail wipe. Oh, she's grinning again. She she's definitely a sweet one. That's for sure. Oh, hi there. The, these two seem to be getting along quite well. She's actually a little bit injured, though. Look at that. Look at that. She's slightly damaged. And speaking of injured, Mayhem does have a minor injury himself. Uh, he's not uh, not too terribly hurt, but he's been fooling around with the Wapiti Pack. And I think that actually might be something he wants to uh, wants to go do again. Go bother Wapiti. Go see how they are. Uh, how how they're doing. If he can steal another hunt in their territory and see if maybe with 13F by his side, they can finally chase off that pesky, pesky duo that's been bothering him. Who's this? Hold on. Oh, you are you are still here. I thought maybe you ran. This is 4M, isn't it? It is 4M. All right, get bitten twice over this time, Hecker. <laughs> ah, these two are, are quick to jump in. Ooh, I do think she is quite bold as well. Look at her just running right in. This man don't stand a chance. And I think our, our carcass is actually still here, it looks like. Yeah, get out. Get out. Wow, they just demolished him. Okay, let's let we'll give a good howl as well. Let's go ahead and see if we can actually find our carcass. See if that's still left over, because I don't know how hungry she is. Is she She's a little bit hungry. Well let, let's bring her over here. Oh we We can steal their territory. 
Oh, I think Mayhem has found a new proper goal. Aha, here's our carcass. There's coyotes on it. You can go. Or rather, you don't have to go. We're not leaving, I don't think. Uh, not if I have anything to say about it. Oh, and it looks like Quadrant 13F shares the same, uh, the same, um, same, same, I, what is the word? Same conviction about it. Yeah, he ain't going anywhere. Oh, are you? Oh, no, you're a fox. It's okay. We'll let you stay. You can have a little nibble. Oh, never mind. She says no. She would like the, she would like the food. She just grabbed the poor guy by the tail. Oh, no. Well, you are certainly welcome to have this. We we did bring it down earlier, uh, and now that we know that we can we can we can we can take territory from Wapiti, I think that might be what Mayhem wants to spend his day doing, is going around bothering them, stealing their territory, and just all in all harassing them as much as he can. I guess it seems like he has a. Uh, He's gotten, he's gotten someone who, who quite understands him in that regard. Yeah, if we stand here and howl, uh, then can we actually claim over this? I bet we can. I bet we're able to. Yeah, so you can't actually claim territory, but you can decrease other wolves' claims on their territory. And I think having learned this, that is exactly what Mayhem is gonna do. He's gonna- oh, they're so mad about it too. He is gonna run around, cause some shenanigans, as he gets to know Quadrant 13F here. Oh, here's another one. It is quite a full territory, but nothing a little howling can't fix. There probably is. Is there a scent post somewhere? Maybe not. Are we in there? No, we're not in their home hex. Okay. They do have a rendezvous site somewhere, but... Uh, oh, and we can drop it quite efficiently, can't we? They're howling, trying to bring it back up, but uh, they're they're not gonna succeed. We're we're gonna get them. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna take this territory down and steal it away from them. If you're going to bother Mayhem, he's gonna unclaim all of your territory and leave you the hard work of getting it back. Is this the source of one of the streams? I think it is. Oh, it looks like it's flowing up from underground somewhere here. Oh, that's really cool. Oh my goodness, there goes a moose, all right. And some bison in the distance. Well, this is still the territory we've unclaimed, but we're pretty close to one that we haven't. I, I think Mayhem is just gonna steal away as much of this territory as uh, as he can here. Oh, there's some bears. Well, it's not you we're here to bother. You can sit there in the back in background and roar at us though if you want. Uh, we, we will happily chase you off if that's really what you want, but uh, I don't- I can't imagine it- it would be- oh, 13F is thinking about it, too. She's over there looking at him. She's eyeing him up over there. <laughs> she- she is- oh, baby bear's getting a little close. Did you find something to eat? Did you find something to eat? No, I think she's just sniffing. Are you thinking you're gonna be a problem? Is this what you want? No, I didn't think it was. All right, let's go ahead and howl now that we've chased him off. There we go. They are booking it out of here, that is for sure. Oh, and we're on cooldown. I think we're actually pretty close to, as well, to, um, to, to finalizing the courtship. Oh, and we've claimed this territory, Hex. We'll give it one last howl for good measure. Look at them howling back, thinking that they're gonna reclaim it. They did not expect Mayhem to cause this level of shenanigans, I don't think, but here we are and here he is. Oh, our injury's better too, that's good. That means we can actually hunt if we need to. We haven't seen how these guys have hunted either. Um, I think at the moment, uh, Mayhem is a little bit caught up in some petty bullying. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's a little bit of a petty wolf, I think. He, he tends to... He's not gonna take lightly to the pack, causing him so many problems and harassing him so much. He's going to cause them a few problems in return and unclaim as much of their territory as he's reasonably able to. But I think, oh, these guys are bonding. They, they, oh, oh my goodness, and she is impressed. All right. Um, honestly, I think he would say yes. This is not the most well advised decision, but they just, you know, 
they vibed really hard right off the bat. They really got along. And I think he is very much feeling that they, they, they got along so well he feels confident about this. Even if it's maybe not the most advisable thing to do, considering we have no idea how well she hunts. We're kind of just banking on her being a good huntress, and we don't have any real proof for it. But this is Mayhem. He's a bit of a chaotic lad. He's gonna say yes. And I think... I think we're gonna go ahead and we'll actually... We will call her Malarkey, because that, that just feels like a fitting name. Mayhem and Malarkey. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna unclaim a little bit more of um, of this territory too, because that 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 just seems like a fitting thing for Mayhem to do as a goodbye gift, and then we'll head ourselves down to the uh, territory there. Let's finish at least unclaiming this one. Oh, are you guys thinking you're gonna fight us? I see some pretty close howling on the map. Yeah, you're not gonna win. Maybe we'll get one last tussle in with 1M and uh, 3F before we go. <laughs> I think Mayhem is a little bit... I, I don't know. He, he, he kind of has a personal beef now. Just a little bit. He, he's got one final score he's hoping he can settle. We are unclaiming a lot of Wapiti territory. Some of them are pretty mad about it too. <laughs> Uh, we are just about to take another hex. We're not claiming it for ourselves, of course, but yeah, we're just... Oh! Oh, oh who's this? Oh, this isn't who I was hoping for. Oh! And they're already gone! Well, let's go ahead and give one final, uh, one final howl to add some insult to injury there. Uh, they are leaving. This ain't your territory anymore. Yeah, you should go back to your home axe because that's all you're gonna have left by the time we're done here. No, we're not gonna bother taking all of this. Oh! What do you mean you think you're claiming this territory back? You're not. This is ours. Who's howling? Oh, somebody else is coming to fight us, I think. No, you guys you guys are not claiming this back. You guys are not claiming this back. We're keeping it unclaimed. They'll take it back pretty easily. Mayhem is just, like, mostly focused on making them have to actually expend a little bit of effort to do it. <laughs> but he's not... He's not going to cause him any serious problems. He's just going to be a slight bit petty. Um, but I think we'll go ahead and we'll take these two as well and see if anybody shows up. See if uh, see if, if 1M and 3F show up one more time before heading off to Slough Creek and uh, seeing what adventures wait for us there. This is the last hex that we'll take, I think. If you look here, this we've, we've unclaimed pretty much everything. It won't take them long to claim back. There's no one really challenging them for it at the moment. But we've inconvenienced them slightly, just like Mayhem was inconvenienced <laughs> slightly. So I think he's satisfied, and these two will be just fine to head off to Slough Creek after this. And there, their challenge will really, truly begin. As a reminder, Mayhem has a denless challenge, which means that we're only going to be choosing a den or rendezvous site when we actually have to, which is at the very start and the very end of the game. Pretty much, I don't think there's anywhere in the middle that it forces you to have one. If it ever does, we'll claim one as long as we need it. But I'm pretty sure the only times that you're required to have a den or a rendezvous site are to choose a den in the first place and to have a rendezvous site at the end of the era. And there we go, we've claimed all this territory. So we'll have these two head down to Slough Creek. We'll let them run down and, and get there and then we will see them on the other side. All right, well, we've made it down to the creek as night is falling without a vent. And these two are ready to cross the mountains over here and head to Slough Creek. But with that said, I think we're going to let them do that in the next episode because it is going to be about that time again. So we will leave these two here for now. And next time, ooh, there is the umbrella here. Next time, we will be catching up with them as they enter the snows of Slough Creek to start staking out a territory. Territory is going to be more, really? We're going to do one last fight? You're going to interrupt my outro? You're going to interrupt my outro? I don't think so, 4M. You can leave us be. 
But yeah, territory is going to be pretty important because we're going to be dealing with this heckery otherwise. And uh, these guys are going to be constantly giving us a hard time and we won't have a den for the uh, pups to retreat into. They'll be able to go in the grass, of course. But we just want to be careful so that we can minimize as many attacks as possible because otherwise it's going to get a lot more of a challenging challenge. But we're going to go ahead and leave this off here for today because it is getting to be about that time again. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys next time. But until then, this is Jay. Over and out.